Alright, hey everybody. Uh, I think I got the mic working now, but I'm not quite sure. So yeah, I had to uh, redo this a few times, but uh, I finally got it to work. Because I re-looked at my previous videos before I uploaded them. If you don't see this uploaded, then it didn't work also. So uh, let's, let's get straight into this. Hopefully, it works. Betty Fazbear's Pizza! First night I had to replay it. This is my second time playing it. So uh if this is loud on the recording, I'm sorry, but uh this is kinda hard to talk because this is my first obviously video with it and I was just a phone guy. Hello. Uh I wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. Um I actually worked in that office before you. I'm finishing up my last week now as a matter of fact, so I know it can be a bit overwhelming, but I'm here to tell you there's nothing to worry about. Uh, you'll be fine. So let's just focus on getting you through your first week, okay? Uh, let's see. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company that I'm supposed to read. It's kind of a legal thing, you know. Um, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike, where fantasy and fun come to life. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or person. Upon discovering that damage or death has occurred, a missing person report will be filed within 90 days or as soon as property and premises have been thoroughly cleaned and bleached and the carpets have been replaced. Blah, blah, blah. Now, that might sound bad, I know, but there's really nothing to worry about. Uh, the animatronic characters here do get a bit quirky at night, but do I blame them? No. If I were forced to sing, those same stupid songs for 20 years and I never got a bath, I'd probably be a bit irritable at night too. So remember, these characters hold a special place in the hearts of children and we need to show them a little respect. Right? Okay. So just Maybe. be aware, the characters Maybe. do tend to wander a bit. Uh, they're left in some kind of free roaming mode at night. Uh, That's not something too about bad. their servos locking up if they get turned off for too long. Uh, they used to be allowed to walk around during the day, too, but then there was the bite of 87. That sounds yeah. fun. Yeah, it's amazing that the human body can live without the frontal lobe, you know? How'd you uh, know now, that, concerning How? your How'd safety, you know that? the only real risk to you as a night watchman here, if any, is the fact that these characters, uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume on. Now, since that's against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, they'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. That doesn't sound um, too fun. Now, that wouldn't be so bad if the suits themselves weren't filled with cross beams, wired, and animatronic devices, especially around the facial area. So you can imagine how having your head forcibly pressed inside one of those could cause a bit of discomfort and death. If you hear that the clicking noise in the background, that's just my chair. I'm sure it's a pretty old chair. The front of the mask here. Yeah, they don't tell you these things when you sign up. But hey, first station of the breeze. I'll chat with you tomorrow. Hopefully. Uh, check those cameras and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. Got to conserve power. Yep. All right. Good night. night. Well, uh, good night, fun guy. Uh, so what we've learned from this, they get quirky. I'm quirky. Um, <coughs> Pirate Cove. I know that Chica's pretty fat because she's even holding food right now. Uh, if she walks, it's gonna be an earthquake. A minor earthquake. When she comes to my door and opens the, uh, opens her mouth, uh, by the window, because she opens her mouth, opens her mouth, uh, it's gonna be a black hole, because she's gonna, uh, uh, do something to the Earth's gravitational pull. I don't know what I'm talking about. Long story short, she chunk it. 
be really chunky. You know, how much is a uh, hour in this game? Is it is it like five minutes? Oh, he's right there. He's right there. He's right there. Okay. I don't know why I sound like I'm panicking even though I'm not. How do I uh, click uh, this person's nose right there? So if you guys play FNAF on Xbox, you probably already know this, but this is a fun fact. Uh, if you hit X on your controller, like when you're facing this way, this little cupcake will like do a little Arr! sound or something like that. Please nobody take that out of context. Body boy is still sitting there. I don't know if you guys want to know what the, my recording software is. Not like it matters that much. It, it probably says at the top up here somewhere. I think it does at least, but it, if it doesn't, then here it is. Uh, I use Bandicam, so yeah. Yeah. Oh, someone's moving. Okay. Where's the fat girl? See what I mean? She chunk it. Oh, hi, hi, Foxy. I, did, I thought you just didn't show up until night three. Where's that? See, I told you if she walks, she's gonna cause an earthquake. I can hear her from all the way across the pizzeria. Okay, where is Bonnie, actually? Fun. Yeah, try to come at me now, you chocolates. Try to get me now. Oh, there it is. Yeah, hold on. I don't need that, then. I'm a man. So, how have y'all's days been? <laughs> oh, I think that is fun. By the way, uh, only Chica pops up on the side if you're new to FNAF, which I don't think anyone is, because FNAF is like 10 years old. And we need like one more hour until it's 6 a.m. So let's go! Now, for not doing really anything besides shutting doors, looking at cameras, and lighting up the place, this still is a relatively fun game. I think this is the first game that does something like that. Keyword, I think. Is that body? Oh, that's totally not horrifying. Okay, what is that noise? Is Bonnie? I think you, I think that's him right there. Yeah, because of the legs. Oh, hey there! Hey there! Well, of course you wouldn't want to poop on the floor. Imagine if she had uh, someone had to make the, a rule to not poop on the floor. Like, who does that? <laughs> who does that except for a toddler? Like, who does? That? Yeah, yay! Alright, uh, I'm gonna leave it here, y'all. Uh, let's subscribe. See you later.